The number of overnights you have in a parenting plan is so critical to how everything is going to unfold once your final judgment is issued. For starters, child support is primarily determined based upon whether mom or dad has a majority of overnights, a minority of overnights, a lot or a little. Number two, if the child expresses a clear preference once they get a little bit older in their teenage years, and the person they really wanna live with has minority time sharing, 70 overnights, 120 overnights, this could be problematic with the co-parenting relationship, and it could be problematic as far as what happens with that minor child's happiness and the conflict that that tug of war between parents may create. And third, there is another issue you should be aware of with majority overnights is if you have a minority of overnights and the other party has a majority and you want to modify that time sharing plan it's not simply a matter of starting another case with a supplemental petition you need to have the right circumstances and you need to meet that statutory standard or else your petition supplemental though it is may be subject to dismissal